Hello and good evening. Well, it's official. Spring is now summer. And you've done all your hard work of planting your garden, but you've still got some bare spots that you don't really know what to do with. Well, I've got two words for you. Ornamental grasses. Let's see what I'm talking about. This is an ornamental grass, a Carl Forster ornamental grass, to be exact. And I had a row along my fence that was just waiting to be taken up by four Carl Forster grasses. I planted them next to the cedar hedgerow that you may have seen in a previous video. Well, I got these from the local Menards and they're supposed to grow about four to six feet tall and you get little truffle stuck stacks on, on top. Uh, so this one was planted this year. Yes, sorry. It was planted this year and uh, well, it takes about two to three years to grow to full to full maturity, so probably won't get that tall this year. But as you can see, I planted them about three, four weeks ago, and they are still green, which means that they're growing. This one is a little bit different. It's a it's a porcupine type of uh, plant, grass. It has some, some stripes. Yes, hello Aria. You always have to be the center of attention. It's not an ornamental grass at all here. This is an iris. We'll see how that does in a year. The other kind of grasses that are, I'm really looking forward to are our flame grasses. And these ones uh, grow about four feet tall, three to four feet tall. And they bush out a little bit wider than the Carl Foresters but during the end of summer, they get a really nice bright kind of crimson orange. And what I did was I oscillated along my back fence line, uh, some flame grass, Carl Forster, and this one's a little bit taller, flame grass covered up by Aria Shadow, Carl Forster, flame grass, Carl Forster, flame grass, flame grass, flame grass, flame grass, flame grass, flame grass, and then some lilies. So that's the back fence line. And that's Aria. And there you have it. If you ever want something extra, easy maintenance type of plants. Just plant some ornamental grasses. You won't regret it. This one's about three feet tall. Three foot tall, flame grasses, or in between. A quick note on ornamental grasses. You have to look into the hardiness zones of where you can actually plant them. The Carl Forsters and flame grasses are rated zone 3 through 9, I believe. So, minus 40 to something hot as well. And you should be good with those. But some grasses only grow in like South America, such as the hardy pompous grass. It will not grow in Minnesota, and nor should you plant it. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching, and... Hope you learned a little bit something about ornamental grasses. I know I sure have this year. Thanks for watching. I hope you like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.